Hey there, it's me Red Knight and welcome back to my channel for another how-to video. Now this one I'm going to show you how to log out of your Supercell ID and some options that you've got from that stage onwards. It could be going back into the game via one of your Supercell ID accounts or it could even be setting up a brand new farm and saving that with Supercell ID. Now, Supercell ID is definitely something that is very useful for us as players within the game. With Supercell ID, though, if you wanted to, you can actually switch between farms. You can transfer farms from one device to another device, and it allows you a lot more freedom and security that you wouldn't have without Supercell ID. Now, logging out is one of these features. You can log out from your game. Game progress is safe because it is Supercell ID. And it will take you back to this loading screen where it has two options. The top one is logging with Supercell ID. And if you have farm saved, this is where you click on that one. And then basically it will load up those farm choices. And then you can just pick and choose which farm you want to open up. The other option down there you've got is play without Supercell ID. And this is playing a farm that you haven't saved. And it's like creating a brand new farm within the game. So this one is not connected to any email addresses. And it's a new farm. So let's just say we click play without Supercell ID. The connecting option happens. And we wait and we wait and we wait. And up comes a farm. Now, if you do think, oh my god, I made a mistake, that's okay. You can then just go up into the settings again, go back and then do what you want to do and then log in the correct account. Or let's just say that you wanted to make a brand new farm. Again, same situation. You just follow the process of the game until you actually get to the stage where you can go up into the top hand corner where the settings are. And then again, you can either save this as a new farm or you can go back to an existing farm. Now, if you do go back to an existing farm this farm you see here will be lost but let's just say that you decide to keep it and you decide to play it now maybe you don't have an email account and you want to play it and then maybe uh, save it a little bit later but there's a possibility you might make a mistake and you may lose it it's like no I've lost my farm because it's not saved I can never get it back again this is where Supercell ID is very useful now there's another option you have down here if you see the credits within the settings section here it's the left hand side second icon click on that credited and up will come a load of information about the game but it also gives you a specific ID number that relates to the game load itself you can write that number down and that's the number that we used to use in the past for giving to a heyday to deal with any issues now with Supercell ID it's much much easier but that's a useful number to remember now, if I click on the login button, it will come up with the blue box um, and then it will come up with my existing accounts and I can switch from this like new farm to one of my normal accounts. I can log in with Supercell ID or register a new Supercell ID account. Now, in the case of registering a Supercell ID account, this will save this farm I've just created as a brand new farm. If I click log in to Supercell ID, it will s open up an existing account I've already got and I will lose this brand new farm that I've just started creating. So it's the green one that you want for saving the farm. Now, you're going to need an email address. Now, I've actually asked behind the scenes for Heyday in relation to the Gmail Plus accounts, and I'll confirm that as soon as I know the information. But when you have a lot of emails uh, or a lot of accounts, you need a lot of emails. Each farm needs a specific email account. They can't be the same. They have to be different. And once you've got that email, then you can start creating and saving a Supercell ID account. Now, it's very simple. You just get your email. You type it into the first box and then you type it again into the second box. And then you click the little box and then you place the register. This will now start you through the process of actually saving this brand new farm that you've got so this is the easy way of creating a new farm if the emails are okay and it matches they give you the green tick marks and then you are ready to go now once you've actually saved this farm with supercell id uh, you can log in log out change farms switch between the farms you can do whatever you like a new farm will be added to your list and you've got the opportunity to go backwards and forwards if you don't save this farm with this option then if you do switch farms you will lose this brand new farm and you will never be able to recover it back or get it back unless of course you can use the credit number to actually try to recover it that way right now that's a how-to bit of information i hope that it gets
gave you a good idea on what logging out and some options you've got. If you've got any questions, please do let me know down below in the comments. You can also support me by typing in code red knight into the green box. Now, I will be providing more videos for the how-to range because I'm being asked questions, hence the fact I'm doing all of these at the moment. So check out the playlist. If you've got any more questions, ask me later. As I said, type them down below in the comments box. Don't forget to subscribe and I will see you next time. Bye now.